Okay, it's just your real three and how to make pom-poms at home with household objects. And this is the giant pom-pom. And you really don't need anything at all for this pom-pom. Just a ball of wool and some twine. So, this one's not for the faint-hearted, by the way. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go for this big ball of orange wool. And I'm gonna take some orange twine. Now, I'm using twine because it's just a little bit um, harder to break and we want to get this as tight as possible and sometimes yarn can just snap. So, I'm gonna put the yarn, the twine, sorry, round the middle of the ball of wool and I'm gonna tie a knot and pull it as tightly as I can. Then I'm gonna flip it over, keep pulling and tie another single knot and pull as tightly as I can. I'm gonna finish it off with a double knot. So now you can see your ball of wool is kind of in two halves. Okay. So first of all, I'm gonna take some sharp, sharp scissors and I'm gonna cut about halfway down one side like this, if I can. Okay, so we've done that. You'll now see you can kind of pull them out a little bit. Now don't pull them too hard because some of your wool will start to fall out. And you'll see there's kind of loops here. So you've got, still got loops. So you want to now just work your way around and chop those loops of wool that you have. So in here, see all these? Yeah. And you can see a pom pom shape starting to happen. So I'm just gonna do the same on the other side. So I'm gonna cut halfway down. I'm actually gonna do it in two halves, a little bit easier. Open it up again. And then chop all the loops that you still see. So like these kind of loops you can see here. And there you have it, you've got a big pom-pom. So now I'm just going to start trimming it into a more of a round shape. And there you have it, a giant pom-pom.